All right, so we're already done at GT's now. We're all finished up. So this is what GT's looks like. This is all snowmobiles. And James wants to go. So I guess we're gonna go. I got some parts. Spent like 70 bucks. I'm trying to turn around if you're wondering what I'm doing. No. Oh. I got a cinnamon roll. Look at that. <laughs> you got a cinnamon roll. So what did we get? We got a snow flap, uh, grills, a belt, and a little rubbery cap type situation. I might have to get you to shift for me at some point. Let's we'll do a quick little glimpse here while we drive by. This is why we come here. Look at all the parts. There's an Arctic Cap Panther. It's an old one. And the dog. Oh, we're going the wrong way. Oh, we're going the wrong way. Oops. Look at that Arctic Cat. Hmm? It's back at Subway. <laughs> <laughs> See ya. Wrong way. Dog. This way out. Oh, I oh, because that sign kind of makes sense, eh? Only when you see it. So yeah, we got some parts oh, and stuff sure and different things. Screen. Oh yeah, there's a snow scoot right there. All their uh, random crap. Vegeta. Yeah. Just like mine. That one looks a lot nicer though. Yeah, it's in better shape. Are so these we all customer stuff over here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. A broken ass windshield. That would have been a nice windshield if it wasn't broken. So we came here to get a grill vent. That grill vent right there. We came here to get that. I didn't get a grill vent, grill vent, but I got a snow flap, a new belt, that rubbery thing, and some grills. Actually, where did I put them? Are they in the back of the truck still? Yeah. Can you just pull over a second? I want to put them in here so they don't fly out or nothing. Hammer down. Oh, lock the door. Where did I put them? Ah, there they are. These are the ones that just go up in here, kind of like that. Got the SDX. Oh, you think that's funny, eh? <laughs> Don't. Gee, ow! I just break my freaking door, James. Don't be an idiot. You can break yourself before the door breaks. Uh. <laughs> Camera. So. Where are those huge trailers he says he was towing? I don't know. Oh, those ones there, those big tandem ones. Oh. But, uh, yeah, we didn't I do any... says apparently 5.9 Cummins has more power than the 6.7. Well, the 5.9s were better. Yeah, they're better, but... I don't know oh, if they have the seatbelt going on here. You'd have to test drive them both and try to do diesel burnouts in both, and then you'd be able to go. That's it for that place. Yeah, there's kind of a dick anyway. Well, he has parts. That's why we go there. Yeah, but everything is just so freaking expensive. I know. Well, except for the rubber thing. That's kind of reasonable, actually. Like, two bucks for that? That's not bad. That's pretty good, but that's just a little rubber thing. That's why they're only two bucks. Yeah, but still, like that's nice to have because they're always broken and cracked and falling apart. Yeah, that's true. That snow flat was only 15 bucks. Remember that cheesy little tiny Yamaha one I wanted before? The guy won. Was it 20 bucks for it? And it was just a little, like a little crappy one. The guy the... in Durham? Yeah. No, he only wanted 10 bucks for that one. Oh. Well, this one's a lot better anyway. This is the same one that's on yours, isn't it? I don't know. I'd have to look. We'll Probably. Look. Oh. I didn't mean I'd have to look at mine, not yours. Oh. I know what yours looks like. It's a random guy just walking down the road. That's cool. Okay, nice haircut. Nice teaching, uh, teaching the cigarettes? Are you, are you teaching? Teaching, he's like five years old. <laughs> All right, well. Uh, once we get back, we'll just throw all these parts onto it and see how much better it looks. Get you guys video later.